what's up youtube so i'm back and as you can see by the title i'm taking y'all to work with me today y'all and i'm not gonna lie i'm running a little late so i'm not gonna tell y'all what time it is but just know i'm like five minutes over my head time right now we had pt this morning so i had to take um a shower usually y'all honestly depending on how sweaty i get if i don't get that sweaty i can just freshen up you know take a bird bath but when i get like super sweaty and we run and it's like i know i'm like okay girl you probably can't go to work like that then i take a full-on shower and because of that it puts me behind on time a little bit then as y'all can see i got my hair down which like i told y'all natural hair is a struggle so it's not as easy for me to just go all i gotta do right now y'all is fix me some coffee and warm up my breakfast today's nothing special y'all i honestly am not doing much at work um i am supposed to go on this podcast later tonight if that goes as planned then i'll definitely make sure i get some of that for y'all and definitely try to bring that video to y'all as well if the guy i'm working with if i'm able to do that you know so we are working tomorrow it's a saturday because we're about to do genesis um it's like a computer system for patient care and we're transitioning into this system so they have us like going live tomorrow so they have us coming in and doing like a whole skit to make sure we're gonna know how to do it when it comes monday so yeah y'all make sure you like the video make sure you are subscribed follow me on my social media ig keona p underscore and snapchat just keona p all right y'all so all i have to do is grab my backpack i already have my water in there you know i take the same backpack every time i'm gonna turn off this light in here I got my window um, curtains open. Besides that, the only thing I think I'm gonna need is uh, nothing. I don't think I need nothing else in here. So I'm gonna to warm up my food and my coffee. So, I'm gonna filter y'all because I'm so picky. I don't trust tap water, especially not when it's not my house. So, just use this every day. Just using some cheap coffee I got from the commissary, nothing special. But, y'all, if it helps, it helps you to save money. So, I will have to be running up and back and forth to Starbucks. So, one of my breakfast meals on the go. It's gonna be this Jimmy Dean breakfast bowl for meat lovers, 23 grams of protein. Y'all, this is definitely not the healthiest compared to you making your own. The worst thing about packaging meals like this, y'all, is you can see the saturated fat is 75%, which of course, like eggs, you got, it has potatoes, all that stuff is gonna equal up to fat, but let me see. And then like the sodium is high, so that's why you're not supposed to get used to eating packaged meals, but I do what I gotta do for right now. So I like this um, white mocha chocolate uh, creamer. Now, I've been drinking coffee since yesterday because I've been feeling, feeling a little more tired than usual. But normally, um, I make me some matcha tea and y'all will probably see me make this um, one week that I show y'all my eating um, routine. And then I mix that with like almond or silk uh, milk and then that's what I'll drink as my caffeine in the morning coffee means mood like coffee is just a vibe by itself y'all so i'm in like the mood and just a vibe for coffee this morning i didn't want my tea so it just make me feel a little more i guess ready for work all right y'all so while we wait on my food i want to answer a question that somebody inboxed me about on instagram yeah, she asked me, was it true about the med come transitioning into force come or whatever, right? And I just want to let y'all know that, yes, that is true. We hear that talk all day long, y'all, at meetings. When we go to our junior enlisted uh, development program, they talk about it all day long, basically letting us know, are y'all prepared? Are y'all ready? Because basically wanting to transition us into being a field unit, so doing more feel like and soldiery things more often than not. And like I always tell y'all, my unit, well, my section, uh, we do a lot of that anyway. So for me, I'm just like, I mean, I don't really see what's gonna be different. I mean, y'all make us do everything anyway, but now it's gonna be official. But 
the thing about that is y'all they're just kind of letting us know that that is that transition is happening that it's not i guess solidified yet so i'm still waiting on more information but once i get more information i'm gonna let y'all know and guess what another thing i didn't tell y'all because i'm just kind of like i just hey i haven't got a chance to get around to telling y'all but i don't work at my old clinic anymore. So I'm not an NCOIC anymore, y'all. I'm back a regular tech. I'm at an entirely different clinic now. If you've been watching my videos, if you've been like supporting me so far, I'm sure you couldn't guess why. Just just take a long guess. But it's not like, you know, super deep about the um, switch. I mean, I knew it was bad to happen. I told y'all we have multiple behavioral health clinics. So when, you know, whenever, the situation causes for they switch us up or down anyway. You know, it might not even be about a particular situation. It might just need you to go cover down or, hey, we don't want you here today. We want you over here. And you end up staying there. So that's just kind of what's going on. I don't really even know what I specifically need to show y'all there because, of course, I can't show y'all me actually doing patient care. So I guess I'll just show you just me in a new environment okay so i'm about to wait on my food to cool down then we're gonna be heading to work it's not a game. It's a red So as y'all can see, I'm in a different desk right now. Um, I don't know if I can show y'all the office. Y'all know I gotta be real careful these days because, you know, y'all know why. Y'all, y'all know why. We out of it. I'm in a tech pod right now, y'all. Tech pod is where all the techs work out. I'm gonna use Ermine Wallet. Okay. And put it in the computer. Remember I told y'all all I do at this point is just check my email to see what it is I need to do today. That's what, that's what I'm about to do. It's just a regular day, honestly, today, y'all. I mean, I didn't get a chance to show y'all PT. Um, too tired this morning, so. Okay, y'all, so as y'all can see, I'm in another office yet again. So the reason why I'm switching offices, right, because I'm at a new clinic and nobody accounted for me. So because of that, I don't have a desk, nor do I have a computer. So I just hop on any computer that's available in any office that's available. But this is going on today, y'all, because I know y'all see it's kind of, it's very quiet and it is a four day weekend, not for medical. As y'all know, we do not get a four day weekend unless it's a federal holiday. So I believe it's what, St. Patrick's Day this weekend. So it is dead in the clinic, y'all. Nobody's here. It's nothing going on y'all is boring even my um my co-workers like the other soldiers that's behavioral health they're all doing their own thing right now so i do not have any of them to show y'all right now actually y'all i'm trying to get off early because our last patient is at 12 30 so because of that 
They don't need the soldiers once their last patient leaves the building. I'm trying to wait around. I haven't even went on lunch yet. It is 12.23. So I'm trying to wait on that patient to get in get out. So I can go ahead and get off. Yeah, I'm chilling. Today is actually, you know, a smooth operating day. No pressure today. So, yeah, I mean, y'all at least seeing what I'm up to. I mean. Okay, y'all. So I am back in the room. It is currently 1.41. So I just got word that they're not trying to let us off early, even though as techs, we don't have no patience to tech. So I will be heading back into the clinic probably to just sit there because, you know, that's just, that's just how it be rolling with us, y'all. So um, I'm starving. I have my food um, in the microwave right now, but I'm trying to think if there's anything else I need to tell y'all about right now. Honestly, y'all, I can't even think about anything right now because I'm kind of just like, I got a lot of the stuff that I have uh, to plan for soon. So that's kind of where my mind has been as far as work. And as I complete some of those things, I'll come back to y'all and let y'all know what I have been working on and planning to get done. So that, it's a lot, it's a lot y'all. I can name probably like five things already that I have in the works right now. Maybe with YouTube and a lot that has nothing to do with YouTube, just life updates. So I will come to y'all really soon with that information. Okay, so that's my food, finally. I made like some um, baked rigatoni pasta. It's so good, let me show y'all. See, this is like day five, y'all, I swear. But it helps me save money and it helps me to eat in the house rather than going and buy fast food, okay? So yeah, I'm gonna let that cool down. I'm about to call my man for a second while I chill out. I'll just come back to y'all with whatever I do next, okay? All right, y'all, as y'all can see, I'm back in the room. I'm oh, sorry, I did not get off early today. We have to report to work at 0750 for this um, computer transition that I was telling you about the healthcare system. As of now, the vlog is still going, so make sure you are subscribed. Make sure you like the video, okay? Hey, y'all, so I actually forgot to record me at work today. We were only there for two hours. And right now, y'all, I'm actually apartment shopping, which is a part of the news I said that I'm gonna share with y'all when the time comes. But right now, that's what I'm doing, y'all. I'm at the first apartment right now. Since I'm up early, I got more than enough time. This is the first one, y'all. So hopefully nobody knows where I'm at. Okay, y'all, so you have seen the first apartment. So what I liked about the apartment, right? I liked the area, it was very um, quiet, very just conservative over there. And I did like the energy of the apartment manager, uh, the girl that I was talking to giving me the tour. Only thing I did not like was the size of the bedrooms. They were very small, because you know, in the military, I got a lot of gear and I need to be able to put that stuff somewhere, you know? That was the only thing, y'all, just the size of the bedroom. But besides that, I have my rating on that apartment in my head. I want y'all to leave y'all rating for all three of the apartments that I am checking out today, y'all. I'm at the next one right now.
So because of that, y'all, I had to fill out this and then leave it right there. So, so as y'all can see, that's pretty disappointing. I didn't get a chance to get a tour of the um, the actual rooms because I mean that's a big part of making a decision. But so far as y'all can see, the common area is lit. Like that part, no question, is lit. Um, I do not like the area it's a lot of traffic um it's in a busy uh part of town so for me that's i don't like that i like to be very distinct with where i live but besides that y'all i mean the um rooms will be the big uh determinant so i guess i have to come back up here and get a good look at it but as of today i don't have anything okay um as far as this apartment but if you like what you see so far let me know in the comment section As y'all can see, I don't see anybody. Um, y'all thinking what I'm thinking? This might be a easy no, not even a hard no, easy no. <laughs> y'all so from first look as y'all can see it looks nice it's very quiet y'all and the area is in it's nobody like it's just quiet y'all it's not a lot of traffic i like that but it depends on how these uh, apartments look y'all so i'm waiting on a girl to come back i'm about to go get me some food and um yeah i'll be back here when she gets up lunch so Alright y'all, so I'm trying this restaurant and I'm being greedy and I wanted to try the wings, but these some big ass wings and I really do not like big wings, so they probably only gonna get tried and then I'm not gonna eat them. Um, and then they told me to test this drink. I guess they just opened, I don't know what this is. It's like a brown sugar, they said in milk or something like that. I don't know, they told me to, to try it. So, that looks good. And yeah, y'all, I'm about to eat. So I'm currently back at the room and I just wanted to tell y'all what I thought about the last apartment y'all just seen. And y'all, I absolutely, I loved it. For me, biggest pro is the apartment manager energy, y'all. She was on point. Everything was just kind of like very calm and just quiet around the whole like apartment area y'all from when i first seen it like i didn't really see too many people outside a lot of just traffic it was in like its own little area like kind of very much uh ducked off in its own area y'all so that's my air fryer so yeah it was like just ducked off and i love that personally for myself because because i personally don't like being in overcrowded areas so for me that was like a real big like 
yes factor. And if y'all saw the room, um, master bedroom had a lot of space. I like the connection between the guest uh, bedroom and the guest bathroom. I think that's just like a little, a nice little add to it. Um, even like the pantry looked nice. Having the little patio, um, the walk-in closet. I just really like that apartment, y'all. Um, what I did not like about it, uh, that one is more further out than the other apartments that I have looked at. But out of all of them, y'all, I think I have my ratings so far of what I like. Still have more apartments to check out, y'all. This is just kind of like the first few of them that I wanted to go and check out. But yeah, soon enough, y'all. Hopefully, soon enough, you won't be seeing this background anymore. Hopefully, soon enough. But like I said, I'm very grateful to have had this for my barracks room because I know it could have been a lot worse. But you know, when you go out and see apartments and just see just the privacy of that and just knowing that it's a life outside of everything just being so military centered. So yes, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right here because I've been up since 7 this morning you know I had to go to work then I just been ripping and running so I am ready to just chill for a minute but yes if you like this video y'all if you like this type of vlog and let me know in the comment section but make sure you like the video make sure you are subscribed turn on your post notification bell so you can be notified every single time that I post I'm trying to hit my goal 1,000 y'all before the end of this year I have to hit it soon okay but once again stay tuned for the next video and the next Military Monday.